Hey everybody, I would love to share with you my project for um, my entry to Itty Bitty Crafts here on YouTube, Miss Angie. Hey Angie, hey darling. Um, she is having a celebration giveaway and yeah, so I just want to share with you real quick my entry. Um, I'll put the link down below to the instructions if you want to enter. Um, so yeah let me share with you real quick I just made a little bitty banner um, she just requested that whatever you um, made that it would be you know tiny because she does beautiful tiny creations so yeah so let me just share with you I made a banner and I used the Prima Time Traveler's Memories right here this is paper beautiful paper pad and these are her colors. She loves these colors. And then I use this punch right here. This is uh, Stampin' Up! Right here. This right here. It looks like. So, yeah. So I took a piece of uh, some lace from my stash. Then um, I cut out the pieces. And I distressed them with vintage photo, um, Tim Holtz. And then I cut pieces of a doily from Ooh La La Vintage Treasures. Right here, if you can see. And each pennant is the same. And these are Prima flowers that I use the Prima Crackle paint. And then I put the gel, the medium gel on it. Let's see. Soft matte gel, pardon me, and then sprinkled these, this right here on it. Beautiful glitter, very pretty. So I did that, and I put some of the crackle on the little pieces of doily. I'm not too close there, and you can see there, right there, and then I glued these tiny little pearls there and then these are little glass pearls that I put in between each of the um, inside banner there right there and then these little flowers are from ooh la la this right here really pretty cut these little flowers off this right here that I used in a previous um, project so yeah cut those off and then I use, these are wedding pearls, I are, are off like wedding appliques, there, I glued them on there, so there's not a whole lot, and then these are just those flat back pearls that I glued there. So I hope you like this Angie, honey, I really do. These Prima Little Flowers, uh, you know, they have that green all the way around, oops, pardon me y'all. I was looking to see if I could show you if I have one left here. This is what it looks like. On the flower underneath it has like this green all the way around. So what I did was I just cut two, folded it over to give it like, you know, the little leaves that stick out from a rose. Right there. It's not picking up very well. Let's see if I can find. Maybe this one will pick up better. Let's see here. It's so tiny. <laughs> right there. You can see as I folded it over. And then, it, yeah. It looks much better than that green going all the way around. It almost looks like a starfish. <laughs> when it goes all the way around. So, yeah, I just wanted to show you that. So, there are some little tiny details there that I just wanted to show you. So, yeah, there's my entry, and this will be going out, um, well, it's morning time, so it'll go out today, and I thank you so much for stopping by. Again, I'll put her link down below, and be sure to check out her channel. It's an awesome, awesome crafter, beautiful, beautiful creations. So, yeah, I pray you have a wonderful, beautiful day, and I'll be back. Bye now.